Welcome to the Confluence. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high. Like a diamond in the sky. When the blazing sun is gone. When he nothing shines upon. Then you show a little light. Twinkle, twinkle through the night. Then the traveler in the dark. Thanks you for your tiny spark. He could not see where to go if you did not twinkle so. In the dark blue sky you keep and often through my curtains peep. For you never shut your eye till the sun is in the sky. As your bright and tiny spark lights the traveler in the dark. Though I know not what you are, twinkle, twinkle, little star. Now let's see what the poem means. Twinkle Twinkle Little Star The poem Twinkle Twinkle Little Star was written by Jane Taylor. She lived from 23rd September 1783 to 13th April 1824. She was an English poet and novelist best known for the lyrics of the widely known Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high like a diamond in the sky. In the stanza of the poem, the speaker uses very simple language to address a little star in the sky. These lines are the best known of the four stanzas and are often repeated rather than elaborated on. The poet uses a simile in these three lines. To compare the star to a diamond, it is a, as beautiful as and as valuable when the blazing sun is gone when he nothing shines upon then you show your little light twinkle twinkle through the night next anaphora is used when the poet repeats when at the beginning of the lines and two of twinkle twinkle little star this creates a list of features it is when the sun has gone away and nothing else is shining that the star shows its little light Despite being small, the light is powerful and important. Then the traveler in the dark thanks you for your tiny spark. He could not see where to go if you did not twinkle so. It's the third stanza of Twinkle Twinkle Little Star addresses how helpful the star is to travelers that might pass by. They see the star's light and thank you for it. The speaker asks another rhetorical question trying to prove to the star that its light is important in the dark blue sky you keep and often through my curtains peep for you never shut your eye till the sun is in the sky in the fourth stanza of twinkle twinkle little star the poet uses personification to give the star human like features its light is like an open eye and it peeps through the speaker's curtains the eye only shuts when the sun is in the sky. As your bright and tiny spark lights the traveler in the dark. Though I know not what you are, twinkle twinkle little star. Lastly, in the fifth stanza of twinkle twinkle little star, the end sounds from the previous lines are reused and the speaker addresses her lack of awareness about the location of the star. She is okay with not knowing where exactly the star is as long as it continues to light the way for travelers in the dark. Please like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.